But first, fire officials still trying to figure out what started a massive fire that destroyed two homes on the southeast side near Floresville last night. The family which lived in one of those homes devastated after losing everything, including their animals. The night team's Jaffney Gray spoke with them while they were sifting through what was left. This is what remains after massive flames captured by this cell phone tore through a mobile home and an apartment behind it just off of Highway 181 South. <laughs> It's, everything's gone. Lori Farr says their family was getting ready to lock their doors for the night when the blaze approached their doorstep. He said, Mama, he ran out. Mama, Mama, there's fire outside. Fortunately, Farr got her fiance, her 11 year old son, and her 71 year old mother, who has type 2 diabetes, out safely. Sadly, she lost all four of her small chihuahuas. They're right there in the box. I miss them. my baby. These steps lead to the entrance of the trailer home. But just to give you an idea of the layout, this was supposed to be the living room right there, a bedroom. But if you look all the way down there, another bedroom, as you can see, is totally unrecognizable. Barr was able to save some family photos and an American flag that belonged to her son's grandfather, who was a veteran. Among the memories she did lose, her brother's ashes. Her landlord, Bobby Bain, joined the family for cleanup efforts today. When I was coming, you know, you could see the flames from a long distance away and it was just very, very hurtful, you know, to, to lose this. They say though it may be hard to bounce back, they're just thankful nobody died. I just thank God that my mom was safe, my son's safe, my fiance's safe, and that we're all made it out safe. Jaffany Gray, KSAT 12 News.